Hi guys, um, um, I'm Starlet Dam, and welcome to my playthrough of Mountain Blade Warband Prophecy of Pandor. Um, <coughs> I decided to give up my Fallout 1 because I felt it was too violent, I didn't feel really comfortable doing it. Instead, I will do Prophecy of Pandor. Violence is a lot more abstract and it should be a lot more fun. So, my character's gender male, female, pretty female, pretty female, as opposed to male and hag. As the other two genders, I'm going to play a male character. You were born years ago in the land of Barclay, far to the west and south of Pendor. You never knew your mother, who died when you were young. Your father was, uh, he was an, he was an adventurer and took an arrow um, to his elbow. Okay, you were the son of a man who, in his youth, had travelled with a band of adventurers, and many night listened rapidly to your father's tales of brave adventure and sacrifice. But as a sheriff and warden in the outlying towns of Eastern Bark, he was often gone, tracking down, capturing the poachers, outlaws, and bandits who plagued the forest where you grew up. He taught you how to survive in the wilds, to fight, and how to spot and avoid danger. In your youth, you had very little time as your father arranged for me to serve uh, a Barkley noble, kicked me out. Uh, and as a boy, I grew up to be um, a builder, actually, a scholar at the university, no, a builder, yeah, and I left because uh, I couldn't pay my rent, uh, so I'm saying to Pendor. The die has been cast, you have set sail for Pendor. What coat of arms do I want? Thank you, champion, for heeding my call oh. and returning to Pendor. These sort of Mongol looking More ones are pretty cool. We need your aid. Fucking Pendor's dark angels. Yes, please. Yet again, uh, let me quit without saving. Most desperately. Okay. New enemies have invaded us, and old ones have returned in force. Okay. We are poised to seek out the evil goddess Azidahaka and destroy her once and for all. On behalf of the people of Pendor, my champion. Train is really again, important. Take up the sword. Extra leadership. Persuasion. Yeah, one handed. Because uh, uh, pole arms will go up pretty much automatically, hopefully. Um, for those of you who have seen my uh, Fallout playthrough, you'll know you'll know what this name is. Yeah, I love that pun so much. Okay. Oh, God, what an ugly fucker. Oh, pretty goddamn fucking ugly. I don't want that moustache, I just want to find some cool hair first. That was pretty cool. Um, as for the beard... Hair colour. That's... <coughs> the slider doesn't work very well. There we go. I look kind of like a uh, Aragorn. Yeah. Oh, that's right bitches. I got a crossbow. Nice ass. Oh, and a sword. Okay, done. Uh, I want to go to Salion, which is like a sort of traditional medieval kingdom. You travel by car caravan through the heartland of Pendor, green shoots of wheat. Noldor? What, like, um, the Blind Guardian song from their 1998 album? Uh, <coughs> Nightfall all over Middle Earth. Um, no, I know it's a Tolkien reference. Jeez, fucking, don't judge me. Suddenly I hear the rush of blade. Oh shit. Hold on, I just want to. There we go. See what is, who this guy is. Come on, you bandit, or whatever. Shit. Got it. Killed the bastard. 
Yeah. Alright, where's his mates? Because I don't bandits work in pairs. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Are you alright? Well, I guess we're alive at any rate. I'm not sure whether you can say the same for the other fella. This one's less thief to trouble our streets at night, although heaven knows he would be lost. Anyway, maybe you can help me with something. Let's talk more inside. Out here, we don't know who's listening. We do not know who may be watching. The merchant takes you to his house. Once inside, he stands by the door for a while, checking the street, and then finally convinced you have not been followed, begins to speak. Okay, what you got to say for yourself? Actually, what am I wearing? Fur clothing. Hmm, it's not, it's not the best. Merchant of Suffolk. Please allow me to explain my proposition. We've had a real problem with heretics kidnapping young girls for sacrifice. <laughs> it's a common problem the world over, mate. We've discovered numerous girls' bodies, everyone with the heart ripped out. Of late, they've become venturing into town, looking for unwary prey. The watch commander tells us it's because of all the fighting on the frontiers. Fewer men to keep an eye on the streets. This helps them enter unnoticed and aids them in identifying particularly tempting targets. Or well, the girls shouldn't be going out and tempting people. Last week, you see, they took my si young sister. I don't know what my sister was thinking to go wandering alone after dark at times like these. I hope she wasn't meeting a lover. That's, that's, the, her lover was a heretic. Um, you should, uh, really talk to her about that. You're traipsing about too, but you're a stranger here and didn't know how bad things had become. She had no such excuse, but she's my sister, so what can I do? If I don't protect my kin, people will start thinking I can't protect my investments either. What a loving guy. Uh, <laughs> Probably feeling to his sister. And I can't have that. I also confess that I love her dearly and am worried to death about her. Of course, I cannot be I cannot bear the thoughts of her being sacrificed by heretics. So here's my proposition. You look like I've had a bit of experience with a blade. And yeah, that's why I'm playing this mod. Apparently it's the most difficult mod for Mountain Blade War. And more importantly, you must have a bit of fire in your belly. I uh, hope not. <laughs> Just drunk wildfire. Like um like King at Game of Thrones. Or you would be coming to Pendor to seek a fortune. This is what I'm asking you to do. Gather a small ba strong party, track down his heretics to LA, and return my system in good health. In return, learn my lasting gratitude and a bit of silver. What say you? Uh, silver, yes. Gratitude, no. I will rescue your sister. Uh, Alright. Good. Find me again in Tavern here in Salyon after you've got the group together. Then we'll speak about what we do next. Okay. Let's leave. I haven't got a lance, which is a bit annoying. Welcome to Prophecy of Pendor. This mod is designed for the experienced player who has mastered the fundamentals of combat through native or other mods. For those of you who are ready for the experience, we hope you enjoy pop. Mm, I'm more of a metalhead, me, to be quite honest. Saxon Dragon, the pop development team. Saxon Dragon, that's a cool name, because I hate those normal bastards. Alright, let's see. Who's in the tavern? Sail sword. I don't. I don't need to march yet. Minstrel. No. Sail sword. Do you have need of hard sword, sir? Me and six my mates are looking for a captain. We'll join you for three seventy-one dinars. Yes. You choose for sir. My lads know how to keep their sword and earn their pay. Keep their word, not their sword. Iris the Lotus. I know you. Greetings to you, sir. You look like someone who should get to know me. <laughs> Why is that, my lady? I am the local red... Ooh. Ooh. Are they like the dark bird? Oh, she's a prison man. Prison... <laughs> Felicity Flame Tongue. Well met, Kay. my lord. <laughs> oh, she has such a seductive voice. Um... An important thing, I think, in this mod is to ask what people are talking about in town. Like, ask for rumours and stuff. My captain, I've just not had the time to listen for such, so unfortunately I have no new rumours to report for. Oh, that's no fun. Normally they come up with crazy shit, like... Terrible news. Jim... Jim Bob Jenkins has started singing The Bear and the Maiden Fair and shit like that. In the couple of hours that I've played this mod before to make sure I knew how to play it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go around all the and
and I'm gonna get a load of these really basic recruits because despite the fact that they're basic recruits um, they upgrade to some really good troops and that's quite important early on forests there's lots of forests around here I hope there's no like elves because uh, first time I I loaded this mod I decided to, I'd see how difficult the mobs actually were because apparently they're like really difficult so I went into like forest and elves like Noldor elves whatever they're called they're like fucking machine gun mach machine gun bow machine arrow arrow machine guns there we go that's that's an actual thing as opposed to whatever I was about to say um they're fucking insane. What's my party size now? Oh, I don't actually have that much money. I thought I had more than 629 dinars. Well, I'll go Bramberg, Staghart, and back home. Well, perhaps with Bramberg, actually. Bramberg, Mubray. Yeah, I think that's... Militia Patrol? Oh, that sounds cool. No, 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 I don't want to speak with the elder. Shit. <laughs> Misclick. Again, if you've watched my Fallout playthrough, you know that happens to me way too much. I, I, I can't control my mouse. <laughs> that, I can't hold the mountain dew one to other. Gets to my head. Travelling to Asgard. I keep seeing red, and because I played the original sort of Damocles for the original warband, I keep thinking they're Imperial Legionaries, and I get shit scared. <laughs> Hopefully, there's a way to change the colours. Um, all right, let's go back and talk to that merchant. Shit, weekly budget already. I thought I'd only been in here a couple of days. Week ninety-four. That's enough. Wow, they're running, they're chasing deserters. I want to get some uh, Salian halberdiers. Merchant. Splendid work. We have hired enough men to take on the heretics. Travelers entering Salian have told us there is a small group of rogger, ro roggers. There's a small group of joggers lurking on the outside of town. I suspect that they are all from the same band, the one that took my sister. Hunt them down, defeat them, and make them disclose the location of the... There. Very well. I shall hunt for heretics. Like a fucking space marine. <laughs> Purge the heretics! Because that's what space marines sound like. Shit. What do you want? I've been looking for you. Tell me where you keep your prisoners and I'll let you go. Eh, and did you bring silver and hopes of ransoming one of our captives? No, I bought steel. Um, alternatively, I have a credit card. Alright, I have... I've got a tactical plan here. Yeah, holding is important in this game. I always get them to advance a little bit. I wonder if I can get a shield. Deliver 29 damage. Yeah, lead them on a merry goose chase and hopefully some men. Hopefully, these guys will have some decent loot, or a shield, or some shit there. Got one. I love the soundtrack. That guy blew up. 
locked. Oh. Yes, I knocked him over, and I think I did damage to that one. The sort of leader. I love the sort of... Shit. Fuck. Lads, handle this one. <laughs> Yes, a victory, a fine victory, lads. Well done. Oh, I love this. It's got like a little, nice little message. You are victorious. I spare me, spare my life. Let me go, and I'll go far away from you and learn on a and you'll never move me again. I spare your life, but in exchange, I want info, info, bitch. Either you or your fellows, cabinet sister, of a prominent merchant in town. Tell me where you're hiding out. Give me your word that you stop troubling the people of these parts, and you can go free. I, I want to kill you, bitch. Oh, bless you, sir. Bless you. We've done our arm. We've been keeping her in our camp near Asgard. I'll describe the area no in details. There's no mistaking it. Okay. Oh, it looks crap, but I kind of need it. I don't want any of that shit either. I can sell that. I can sell those. I can sell that and that as well. Actually, get myself a shield. Uh, so I've been keeping her near Asgard. So all this bollocks. Um, people probably scream at me like, "What are you doing with your crossbow?" You receive five fifteen dinars. 312 resistance 15 Th 390 resistance 12 uh, this one you receive 110 dinars do they have any better swords? Oh, oh that's two handed turn ok so I think what I'll do actually is I'm going to wait here until I've healed up and then I'll go to Asgard and deal. Where is Asgard? Oh, over there. So, tomorrow morning at dawn, we'll set out. Or early morning, actually. Travel to Asgard. Can any of my men. Oh, yeah. Slightly a militia. Slightly better. can see the kidnappers hide out. Hopefully they're not going to be really difficult and not be... Kidnappers hide out? Oh, it's... Wow! How close is that? Well, who are these guys? Renegade Adventure Company. Oh, shit! Uh, you approach the hideout. The heretics don't appear to have been spotted you yet, and you can still sneak away unnoticed. Okay. Uh, Who have I got for that? Oh, hopefully, these guys will be enough. I hope that adventuring company that's following us doesn't, like, do some shit, because. This is what a dark angel looks like under the armour. Of course. Where is my... Where's everyone else? Oh, okay. I'm... I'm slightly dazed and confused as to where... All these wankers are... Oh, there's one. Fucking hell, thanks mate, but I wanted the XP for that kill. If there's another fucking crossbowman. Got him. Was that it? I've got in some of those really difficult heretic blokes. 
Oh, is that the... Is, is that the merchant's sister? Trying to path up to me and got stuck on a rock. Thank you, thank you sir for rescuing me from this fiends. Did my brother and Sardion put you onto their track? Yeah, yeah bitch. Um, I have to s I told him that I'd find- I mean, uh, uh, yes fair maiden. I told him that I'd find you, advise you to return to your family as quickly as you can and be careful on the road. With their retreat cut off, the heretics fall by one, one by one to your determined attack. They hide out and they're all gone gains and now yours. Lots and lots of food, which is good. I have a horrible feeling. I read on the um, I read on the README that you can you can't just use generic pole arms. You've actually got to have one called a lance. Uh, to shit, shit, shit! Come on, get to the castle! Get to the castle! Get to the castle! If I upgrade, oh no! Shit. I'm gonna have to... There we go. Much better. Hopefully the fuckers have fucked off. Oh no, I paid for accommodation. Who did I lose? Ah, oh, just a recruit. <laughs> Good. Thank fuck for that. I think I'll go up this way, because there's a bridge there. And ho hopefully they went around this way. Plus, I can get some more troops. L what was that? Lord Einar Harry back? Oh, he's disappeared now. I better actually not recruit anyone else at the moment, because <laughs> otherwise <laughs> I'm going to run out of money. Travel to Sarleon. And hopefully those fucking adventuring companies, because it has to be said, everyone in this game is insanely difficult. Or this. Grey Dan, ah, oh. he's not Starlet, Merchant of Salion. Well, my sister is home safe. I'm not sure what to do with her to protect her from future hot folly, but that's not your problem. Here's the rest of your reward. It was well earned. The mo money is most welcome, and I am glad to have been of service, mate. Thank you, gymnastics. <laughs> I'm sad as you go. Good luck in your travels. <laughs> 